Hi guys, Dane here, and today I'm going to be doing the uh, BookTube community tag. This was created by Richardson Reads, and he tagged me in his original video. So thank you for that. Let's go. Question number one, how long have you been watching BookTube? So for me, I would say maybe four or five years, maybe six. Probably about five, I think. Um, I, I used to watch YouTube a lot just while working and discovered booktube and started watching a lot of booktube videos but i never really took part in the community because i only really watch videos when i was at work so i was kind of paying attention but i wasn't paying as much attention as maybe i could have wasn't really leaving comments or anything like that wasn't making my own videos so yeah but yeah it's been a good old while question number two how long have you been a booktuber so technically like three years because I have my book blogs YouTube channel socialbookshelves.com and I don't even use that channel anymore but I used to do just like hauls and occasional like interview videos and maybe the odd tag here and there on that but I didn't really take part in the community again until I started regularly posting booktube videos on this channel Dane Reads which is like my main YouTube channel which I've had for years and I probably started properly in about August, September of last year. So not as long as people think. I haven't been making videos, like I haven't been making booktube videos on this channel for years, but I have I, like made videos on this channel in the past. So I made like gaming videos back in the day and various other bits and bobs. So yeah. Question number three, how many countries do you have on your subscriber list? How many countries booktubers do you subscribe to? So for this, I'm gonna quickly check my analytics. Uh, I don't know how many countries I subscribe to, but I imagine it's a fair amount. We're easily in double digits, maybe 40, 50 plus or something. But predominantly it's UK, USA, Philippines, We've got some Germany, Italy, Canada, some others. <laughs> it's taken me ages just to find this one metric. All right, I'm, I will read down the top countries over the last year. United States, United Kingdom, Canada, Australia, Germany, Philippines, India, Spain, Italy, Netherlands, Pakistan, Ireland, Brazil, Latvia, Mexico, New Zealand, Russia, Finland, France, Norway, Romania, Sweden, Argentina, Switzerland, and Czechia. Question number four, describe how you handle your comments section. Do you have regular conversations with certain people? So yes, I do have regular conversations with certain people. You know who you are. I handle it quite badly. I try and keep on top of it, but I know at the moment I'm like a week behind on my comments. But I will try and catch up. I'm trying to spend about an hour a day either, you know, filming, uh, editing, etc, etc. And within that hour, I've been trying to spend it keeping up with comments, but I've accidentally fallen behind. So I need to do like less filming, more comments. Question number five, do you interact with booktubers on other social media than YouTube? If so, what? So yes, I do predominantly Facebook and Twitter. So I have a few kind of booktubers who are Facebook friends. I'm also in Harriet Rosie's booktubers group, Twitter, um, I've actually started paying more attention to Twitter recently because people are paying attention to my tweets So I kind of feel the need to To fill the void now and actually say stuff I also use Instagram a fair amount and have a few booktubers on Instagram as well question number eight No, sorry question number six. Do you rely on some booktubers for recommendations? Yes, and no in general I get a few recommendations from booktube, but probably not as many as other people because I guess my tastes are a bit different to most booktubers so every now and then I will see like a kind of a mainstreamish book that sounds pretty good but you know other than that I have a pretty good idea already of what I want to read and I have like a list of about 2,000 books that I want so yeah not as much as I should do sorry I, I kind of I kind of rely on them for more for book news than recommendations like I know I like to know what's out even if I don't necessarily want to read it myself Question number seven, do you interact with other booktubers on email, regularly or occasionally? So yes, quite often I use email to organize my buddy reads. So at the moment we've got an email trail for the Amityville Horror going, and we'll set one up for In Cold Blood by Truman Capote soon. I also talk to Todd via email because that's how we coordinate our Todd and Danes indie read along. And you know, occasionally other people, like I chat to Anthony Andrews via email because I sent him some books. For 
Question number eight, with tag videos, do you mix it up or do you tend to tag the same people? So I've just been going into my like comments and just tagging who's commented recently and I'll do that for this video as well. It seems to work quite well. And also I figure if they comment on my videos, it means they probably watch them, which means they'll probably see it if I tag them, you know? Question number nine, have you ever mailed books to another booktuber? So yes, I've sent books to Anthony Andrews. I've also sent a copy of Driven to Charles Heathcote because he sent me a copy of his book in return. I've sent books to Kit Kats Can Read and also um, Missy from Binge Reader as well. I sent her Driven too. Question number 10, have you received books in the mail from another booktuber? So yeah, I've received books from Kit Kats Can Read. She sent me... Um, John Green, Turtles All The Way Down. Question number 11, have you ever visited or been visited by another booktuber? So, yes and no, I met up with Scott from Book Axe after London Book Fair and we went for a pint. So that's the only one that comes to mind. Although I feel like there's another one that I've forgotten, which is really bad. Question number 12, do you do buddy reads? Is it always with the same people? Are they booktubers? Does a bear shit in the woods? I am the buddy reads king, man. So the way I've been doing it for this set of buddy reads, uh, a book a week, and I'll link below actually, there is a, um, a survey monkey form you can fill out to like flag your interest for any of the books. You can read as many or as few as you want. And you're welcome to do that if you are a booktuber. And if so, I ask for your YouTube channel. But if not, you don't have to be a booktuber. So yeah, I mean, the, book, the buddy reads I tend to do are with booktubers and viewers. So, shout out to Lou G. Lou G, get your channel sorted. And question number 13, tag some of your friends. So I'm gonna do what I mentioned. I'm gonna go into my dashboard and see who recently commented on my videos. Mark Nash, Rogers Reads, Anthony Andrews, Weird Reads, One Book, One Review, Caught the Reader, Mindy's Book Journey, Totally Pretentious, Emma Rosen Books, Minx Laura 123, JD Estrada, Graham Quigley, uh, Joe Smith, Although I don't know if Joe makes videos, I don't think she does. And Madman Reads and Rocks. So anyway, on that note, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments your answers, I guess, if you watch any of the channels that I mentioned. Hit subscribe for more bookish videos, and I'll see you soon for another one. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.